Hey YouTube, Not Pipes here, and uh, <clears throat> coming to you from my shop. Decided to turn the uh, iPad around this time and kind of point it at my desk so the lights weren't uh, in the road. That might work out a little bit better. Smoking some uh, Frogmorton Cellar in this little, this is a little eBay pipe I got a long time ago and it's a favorite pipe. In fact, I think I'm going to make some pipes like this. It's small, kind of a little acorn shape. I've shown it before, but I just really like it. It's light. Anyhow, it's been a while since I've done a video, so I thought I'd give you an update. Things are going well. Uh, keeping busy in the shop. And uh, I got uh, a pipe finished up this week, this weekend, that's uh, about to go up to Russell. Well, that's how that's. My wife is making the burlap bags. Got the knot here. See the knot? It's the same knot as on the card here. A little inside. It's, I, I'm not. I, I can't talk with the pipe going on. So let me put it down. <clears throat> Very pleased with how this turned out. This is my first Cumberland stem. So I'll get you a look at the Cumberland. Excuse the lint on it. Um, a little uh, Cherwood Poker Sitter. I took and mixed a little bit of red in the stain with the mahogany just to tie tie a little closer to the uh, the red in the Cumberland. So let's see if I can show you the button work here if, if it'll it's still a little dark. Okay. So anyhow, uh, I do believe that this pipe is, uh, my wife keeps telling me every time I do a pipe, that's your best one so far. And I think that's because every time I do another pipe I'm getting a little bit better. And I've got a nice coordinating, let's just show you here, nice coordinating tamper to go with it. So that... Almost looks like that, like that was cut out of the, the boy. It is from the same. I got some bigger briar blank so I can get some nice. So it's blasted the same. A little bit of lint on there. Anyhow, I am uh, have not put my prices up yet. If anybody is interested at one hundred and seventy five dollars plus shipping, if you want to get on my list, I've got a few people going for this exact same pipe. In fact, what I'm doing now, what I did this afternoon. Get working on the next one that's going to Hawaii. So that's a this is a little bit longer version. The briar block was a little different. Got a little heavier out on the stem here. So uh, what do y'all think of that one? So that's in 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 the works. That's a, it's a deep uh, deep bowl deep bowl on this one. So that one is in the works. Another little thing I'm working on this weekend is I've been working on a new leather apron for a new shop apron. So, boy, I took up a lot of my pipe stain though. I took my uh, took almost a whole. So, this will be the new not pipes shop apron. This is a piece of goat skin that I got. So this is the color, and this is after it being dyed. I love the smell of leather. There'll be the pocket that'll go on top of it. Anyhow, I'm kind of excited about, uh, I want to get my logo on it. Uh, that's the next thing I want to try and do. I'd like to get the Nut Pipes logo on my apron. So I might look and see. Some of you guys that are leather guys could maybe tell me what the best way to do that. I experimented a little bit today to see if I could blast with my blaster and then stain over that area whether it would take that. And uh, it seems like it would. 
And I don't know if that's the best way. I don't, I don't have any tools for tooling, so I don't know whether to look into that or, or not. So, anyhow, I'm working on an idea. Maybe I'll just bounce this off you. My wife and I have been talking about it. We do, um, some of you know, we do uh, wells, water wells for... Um, uh, Living Water International, and we're we're going in June to uh, Nicaragua, and then we're going to El Salvador in September. We're trying to do two, three, four a year. We've had some years where we've done three. We're we're trying this year. We're going to do two, and uh, I don't know that I'm going to be able with my schedule work put a third one in. But I'm working on raising funds for these wells, and so I've got this idea. You can maybe let me know in the comments what you what you think about it. We've, we've got a name for it, and we think we're going to call it Smoke on the Water. Da, 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 da. I don't know, we could do it. I, I, I just, uh, this whole idea sounds kind of neat to me. Um, smoke on the Water. Uh, we would have an account set up that you would put a donation in towards uh, our expenses on going on this well trip. So all the money, all the proceeds um, would obviously go to the well you would put $250 into as a donation, you'd get a full tax receipt from Living Water back in that, and then I would gift you a pipe for your donation. So it'd be an interesting way of doing this so you get a tax receipt and you know where this money is going. And um, so I'd like to kind of set up a web page and kind of get it set up so the thoughts have been going around in my mind and my wife's mind and we kind of have this concept and we think it could um, could work. Anyhow, I don't know. Tell me what you think. Do you think it would, uh, it would work? Anyhow, uh, basically just keeping busy at work, busy in the shop, uh, working on that pipe I'm working on now is going to Hawaii. Um, I'll tell you, uh, I don't know if i got time to tell the story or not, but it's, it's pretty neat. I, 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 I sent a pipe to South Africa and um, it didn't look like the pipe was going to get there. We were literally in um, week seven and it hadn't got there. So I was, I was actually kind of upset about it and uh, figured I was going to have to remake this pipe. And um, anyhow, th I could take a 15 minutes to tell you the story, but uh, to be honest, I just prayed about it. And I said, God, I need you, to, you know, I really would like you to kind of confirm that you've got this hand, your hand in this business that I'm doing, and I'd like to. Um, do this to raise money so that we can do these. This is, and I haven't really shared this with anybody, but my, my concept here is if I can, uh, as a side job, make enough money uh, on these pipes, that'll pay for uh, my wife Kim and, and my uh, trips down into Central America to drill wells. And so uh, I, was, I was asking for a confirmation, and uh, to, to be honest, uh, I, I don't really have time to tell the whole story, but it was a very, very cool confirmation that this pipe... Um, made it and I got the news that it made it while I was doing some more well training and it was just a real cool confirmation because by all uh, by all you know accounts it looked like this pipe had been you know stolen somebody just taken it and um, so it took two months to get there and it was my first pipe other than selling a pipe to a friend of mine it was my first pipe for sale to somebody that just you know ordered a pipe from me and in South Africa. So it was pretty cool. And the cool thing is, is I kind of put this out as a fleece and said, God, I really, as confirmation that I'm supposed to kind of work on these pipes and do this, I'd like you to, um, you know, I just prayed that, you, you know, you would, you would kind of show me by uh, this gentleman getting his pipe. The cool thing is, is this guy, it turns out his name is Gideon. And I was doing kind of a Gideon's fleece. And that was just another little confirmation. And um, I haven't told you really the whole story. Uh, I probably should have just accounted a video to tell the whole story, but it was a pretty cool deal where I really felt God just kind of, um, you know, gave me a confirmation that this is what I'm supposed to be doing. So I'm having fun making pipes. Uh, enjoy it. Love it. Uh, it's cool that I can get paid for it now. And uh, it's cool that I can take this money and go and help others by uh, drilling wells in Central America and making a huge difference. You know, it's just crazy. We take things so for granted, but uh, these folks to, um, you know, just to have 
a hand pump that's clean water and not infected so the kids can be healthy then they can go to school they don't have to walk for miles to get water and yeah, it's pretty cool so if anybody's interested in that I haven't officially really launched this yet but if uh, if you like the idea uh, I'm hoping that I would get a pretty big list I'm even exploring I'm just talking out loud here now I'm exploring I got a friend of mine that does laser work I'm exploring the idea that I could actually put GPS coordinates on the bottom of the pipe um, for the well location that you've sponsored. So anyhow, give me some feedback. Um, curious to what y'all think. And uh, anyhow, that's a quick update. Pipe business going good. One going out to Russell. One getting ready. Hopefully next week to go to Hawaii. You got a couple more in the pipeline. If you're interested in a pipe, uh, let me know. If you're interested in this sponsorship deal, uh, I want to be kind of first on the list once I get that set up. Let me know about that and I'll give you instructions on how you could do that donation. I have a couple of pipes for sale on the website. This one, I am surprised it hasn't went. Uh, I, I don't know. I like it. I think it looks good. Maybe, I, I don't know. Anyhow, this pipe, the cool thing about this pipe, if you want this pipe, is this is this pipe is numbered pipe number one of 2014. This was the first one I made. Uh, you know, for sale in 2014, and it's a pretty special pipe. It, it's the workmanship is great. Um, anyhow, it's smooth, nice grain. On the site 175 uh, U.S. free shipping. If you see this, uh, notpipes.com. If you go to notpipes.com, these these there's a PayPal buy, buy it now button. I got that set up, <clears throat> and this little this little pipe is pretty cool. A little Liverpool and. Um, I, 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 actually, I'd like to keep this pipe. I really like this. Uh, anyhow, that one is also, it's blasted to halfway. Nice long stem. This was the first pipe I did on my new uh, chuck that I got from Robert. So, this pipe is ready to go. Uh, 150, I put this one out at 150. I think that's a, a nice little pipe for 150. Anyhow. Appreciate you taking time to watch my videos. Uh, uh, if you're not following me on Instagram, not pipes, uh, that's where I kind of keep uh, updates on the stuff that I got going. And uh, we'll talk to you later. See you.